Hi everyone, it's Joy here and I thought it'd be fun to share a quick video with you all um, for La La Land Crafts Tutorial Thursday. I wanted to showcase how you can use your dies more effectively and get a lot more use out of them. So this technique is actually quite common in the industry right now and it's called die cut inlay. So I'm just trimming down some white and grey cardstock and also a scrapped piece of black. Now the white and the grey are trimmed to about four inches by about five and three quarters or thereabouts. So I'm using the diamond wire um, die that you can see here and I'm going to run it through my cuddle bug cutting out the grey piece and then cutting a piece out of the, the black piece that you see here. Alright, so I want to keep certain pieces of these die cuts. So I'm just going to grab a bowl and I'm going to punch out the little pieces in between the die cut that you see here. And I'm going to keep those pieces, discarding the outer area and discarding the little sections in the black as well, but just keeping the diamond wire itself. So here comes the die cut inlay process. I needed a backing, so I'm going to use the white and then attach the grey to the top of it. I'm just adhering that to the top now. And I'll give you a closer look and you'll be able to see that there is now a section for the black piece to drop in. Okay, so taking my two-way glue pen and I'm just going to add some little dots of glue all around this die cut and then place it back into the section that you see here that we've die, -cutted, die cut out before. I'm just going to apply some pressure so that I make sure that it's all really well adhered and give you a quite close look that it's literally one layer all the way across now. So the grey pieces come into play now and I'll just apply some glue to each of the sections that are open and adhere each of these little pieces back in. And as I said before, essentially this becomes a one layer, but it's a really effective way of actually using your dies. Um, I encourage you as well to look at your dies and see what you can actually do with them. Um, this die cut inlay process is really, really fun um, and doesn't take that long at all. So here's a closer look. So I'm going to complete a card for you. I've coloured in the Singing Luca that you see here and I've also stamped out a sentiment that's matching in that stamp set. Just going to add him up with some um, dimensional adhesive and I keep a little bowl on my table um, just to add the backs in there. A really great tip from my friend Michelle. And now I'm just going to adhere the sentiment also with dimensional adhesive. Just making sure I line that up. Okay, so to finish off, I've grabbed some Studio Calico glittered stars here and I'm just adding a dimensional adhesive to the large one. And then I've also pressed um, another two just straight down on the cardstock as well. So there we have it. I'm really happy with how the result turned out and I'm just going to adhere this to a trim card of four and a quarter by five and a half. And I pre-cut that prior to actually doing the video. I hope you've all enjoyed the video. I um, hope that you've actually found some inspiration on how to use your dies a little bit more effectively. And um, for more information, please visit La La Land Crafts. Here's a closer look at the card, and thanks for watching.